Welcome, this is the Energy Vibration Reading for all the Virgo Sun, Moon and Rising. It is the second week of August 2017. The week began from 7 July until 13 July. And I want to say to each and every person, thank you for the support, thank you for the likes and shares. Please remember to listen to your Sun, Moon and Rising. And please keep on leaving the messages. It has been wonderful, um, positive um, endeavor that we're doing and we as we leave a message we're healing each other's so as I look at your week it's going to be a week of cleansing because it's the week of the lovers the week of the lovers come with the energy vibration of the zodiac energy of fire so it's going to be an energy of clearing energies in this week and it's going to be positive because your birthdays are coming up you Virgo so it's going to be um, wonderful so you're clearing um, the year of 2007 2016 and you're about to begin your zodiac year of 2017 okay so this is going to be wonderful no matter how you look at it it's going to be wonderful okay I'm going to look and see what else is coming up because you have for you the three of cups so this is a celebration whatever is happening it is a huge celebration to whatever is happening it's a positive huge celebration of whatever that is happening in your life okay at this moment so this is going to be um, positive okay as I look at your energy vibration for you Virgos, you are going your own energy vibration is here which is good we have the king of pentacles which is wonderful and we have on friday another pentacle energy vibration so tuesday and tuesday and um friday is going to be a positive day for you guys whatever is happening tuesday and friday is going to be a positive day so let's look further to see whatever what on the other energies are here for you guys let's look further um the energies of the knights are here we have the knights of one we have the knight of swords and it's the princess of swords and then and the princess of wands i'm just re realizing that they're princess your week is governed by the moon which is a very very positive thing because this is going to be a very intuition week for you guys whatever is happening it is an intuition week because we have the five of wands and um good things are about to happen there is conflicts but let's see where that conflicts is coming from okay let's see where is that conflicts is coming from let's see what is going to be happening in your week the number four energy is going to be a positive energy whatsoever is happening the number four energy is going to be positive and the number three so your number for the week is going to be three thirty three 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 and then we are going to have four and forty four okay so those are going to be your energy vibration for this week remember this week you're going to have a celebration you Virgos so three of cups is here and it's going to be a wonderful celebration so as we move forward we have conflicts whatever the conflicts is going to be remember that love is the only thing that is real this conflicts is going to be people wants to have conflicts with you over certain things you know people wants to bring chaos in your life and you or um, and it's going to be over money there's going to be conflicts and people want to bring chaos in your life and it's going to be over money okay whatever the situation is it's going to be over money so you have to be aware of whatever is happening so what we're going to do is that whatever the conflicts is um, and you are trying to protect yourself and you're trying to um, um project your your investment okay because this is what it's going to be about people being very jealous of what you have and you're trying to protect yourself and protect whatever you have so be aware of the situation and understand that um whatever life brings to you no one can take it away um 
you know certain things will happen and people are always in conflicts because people do not like to see that other people end up being good and um, sometimes people will do things and I wondered um, if they think about what they do and how their energy vibration is because if you are so jealous that you don't want someone else to be um, to elevate themselves and you know it's, it's, it's sometimes is that some people have things get things in their life because they're so positive and they work hard for it and even sometimes if they don't work hard for it, their family work hard for it so that they can survive and there are the people who are just jealous and wants and wants to have a piece of the pie as if they know how it comes so be aware of whatever is going on on Monday because there is going to be um, conflicts over money so be aware of that and if you want to save your money and hold your money it is your money okay so don't let anyone um let you look as if you're a miser or what whatever the conflict is going to be you don't have to um give your money away on tuesday it's going to be a better day because you have the king of cups and the king of cups uh the king of pentacles which is your own energy vibration and this is going to affect a lot of people who have kids it is going to be a positive energy in the sense that if you have kids and it's just of a um, a Pisces a cancer or a scorpion this is going to affect you because this cat this child is going to really show you how much they love you okay for some people it's going to be a situation where people are actually letting you know that you know they appreciate things that you have been doing and they are happy of you being in their life and whatever the situation is people are going to show you their love on Tuesday so whatever is happening whether you're a man or a woman um, the energy vibration of love is going to be very powerful on Tuesday because whenever it comes in a small form um, it is always a powerful love coming into you and it can come from different different people different your family your kids wh whoever it can come from outside and people really um, appreciative of what you're doing so this is going to be a positive one as we move on and we are going to look at what is crowned in your week we have the energy vibration of the moon so as again i said this week is going to be a real psychic week um, for you earth energy people it's going to be a real psychic week because it's as if your psychic is going to open up in this week for you Virgos it's going to be really psychic your psychic is going to open up and it's going to be positive and it's going to be a positive connection because it has to do with the energy of um, the universal angels beckoning out to you and calling out to you this ascendance masters the guides and angels um, the source of all things is calling out to you beckoned out to you sending you message so this week is going to be an extremely psychic week for you Virgos okay extremely psychic this is good as we move on we have the energy of the Knight of Wands and the Knight of Wands is someone who is helping you to move forward and he comes with the energy vibration of the King of Pentacles so you're here twice in your week so this is going to be a wonderful perform week because whatever is happening some of you um you know have 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 been going through things and um the universe on wednesday um awaken you to connect with your your inner guidance and by connecting with your inner guidance what you're going to see and what you're going to feel is that these positive energies coming out at you and these are going to be very positive whatever the situation is it's going to be extremely positive it's going to be unbelievable because you are going to realize how positive this sort of a situation is and how you can change certain aspects of yourself because you're moving and you want to move and you're going to ask for help and I've been saying to people do not sit in your situation and think 
how am I going to get out of it? You are going to say, how can you help me? Show me the way how I can deal with this situation. Okay, show me the way how I can deal with this situation. So you are going to see that whatever is happening around you, you are going to find that passion within you to move that passion within you to go find that job that passion within you to go prepare yourself for something much better that passion in you that is going to find a, a new study that passion in you is going to come out on Thursday and this is good so um Tuesday and Thursday is going to be an extremely good day Friday Friday we have the two of Pentacles which is good which you're balancing out your financial situation but also your emotion whenever we are at this point this is good especially for you Virgos because what is happening is that you are seeing things differently you're understanding things differently and the energy vibration of the three of ones is here so whatever that has been happening and whatever that has been going on you're going to see that the energy vibration you are going to be um, leaving something behind and leaving the fear the angst and, 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 and connecting with yourself and bringing back self-esteem and confidence and that inner strength to move forward and it's going to help you so whatever the situation is whatever it is think constantly think of what it is that you need in your life and you're going to see that by letting go of some things that moving on to something else you're going to see that it's going to change your financial world and this is going to be good okay as we move forward we have the four of cups and the energy of the four of cups is very very positive whatever the energy of the four of cups is bringing in it is bringing in a balance and this is a good energy of the four of cups because whatever whatever that has been going on in your life there you are protecting yourself this four of cups is giving you um, the time to sit and think about things and by doing that it is showing you how to protect yourself and this is going to be extremely good so whatever the situation is whatever that has been going on whatever um, you were um, trying to accomplish in your life you're going to find the time to make that plan that that really good plan and in that plan you're going to um, protect a way a way forward we have the energy of the knight of swords and this is the energy that I'm getting that it has to do with someone who is having a relationship with an Aquarius a Libran or a Gemini and you are moving away from this person whoever this person is you're moving away from this person you're feeling that this is not something for you and you're moving away from this person whatever the situation was you're understanding that whatever lesson need to uh, be learned you know and you're moving away but he's coming behind you you know it's a situation where you have decided that you're going to end a relationship it doesn't really matter what sort of a relationship was it a friendship was it you know a platoon relationship whatever it was and you're moving away but yet still he's coming after you is as if you know what is it that you want <laughs> Um, because this whatever this relationship is it's not fulfilling you anymore and you're really realizing that this is not what I want in my life and you are like moving further away from him and he's coming after you it's, it's as if you know someone who doesn't really understand that you know um, leave this to rest whatever it was um, whatever situation you didn't do good whatever you know leave it to rest but it's a situation where you're seeing that this person is coming uh, after you even though you're trying to release yourself from them so whatever is happening you know it's going to be a good week of releasing the energy vibration of the men are very strong it's a it's a very masculine week it's a very strong week a very masculine week where the men are learning to let go of stuff 
um, I love your week because it's the week of the intuition it's the week of uh, your psychic energies uh, it's a week of you connecting with the universe and by doing that it's it's gonna work out for you the energy of love is on Tuesday and this is good because whatever the men are going through this energy of love is going to co come full force to you and this is good the energy of love comes back on Saturday which is wonderful which on Saturday you're kind of protecting yourself whatever is going on and it's not bad when we protect ourselves there's nothing wrong but you have the energy of the four of cups so it's a day oh it doesn't really matter what you're doing but you're going to be focusing on yourself you're going to connect with your inner self and you're going to try and find out things but at this time you're kind of setting up barriers around you so that you can focus and connect with yourself to understand whatever is going on around you um so in the first half of the week it's it's going to be um you have conflicts with over money on monday whatever the conflicts that's going to happen um about money on monday it, there is going to be a conflicts about money and then you're going to have a time where you're going to sit and really think about it protecting yourself from the people around you and um it's going to be good because you have your own energy vibration that is um governing the first half of the week and also the second half of the week and as I said um, you know the second half is more that you're finding emotional balance and you're moving away from something and that is true because you have the energy vibration of this night of um, sword that you're moving away from but he's you're moving away from him and you need to leave him behind um, both mentally and physically but you know it's as if you can't get rid of him it's a, a situation that as if you can't get rid of him but you are in control in this week and this is what is good you're all in control this week let's see what is going to happen what energy is going to come out you are all in control in this week and this is good I love a week when energies are in control we're all in control and we have failure seven of Pentacles failure seven of Pentacles okay um, this is a new card deck I'm not really agreeing with what they says so I wouldn't say it's a failure there's nothing in life that is a failure um, the seven of Pentacles is here and the seven of Pentacles is always that you're planting something in this it says failure but I don't consider anything as failure I consider that you try something it never works out but you know this came up and this is what I certain cards I don't agree with certain things that they say on it and this is one of the cards that I really don't agree with this because it's not failure because there's nothing in this week that is failure for you whatever is in this week so we have uh, the energy of uh, justice so if you thought something was a failure it's not because the energy of justice is here and she is carrying the energy vibration of the eight the infinity so this is good thank you my guides and my angels they're so working with me and the energy of justice was just standing up there so whatever that you thought was a failure and loss it is not loss and it's not a failure because this week is just a positive week of you standing up and showing that you're in control let's see what the ascendance uh, card have to say lady portia lady portia so lady portia um is known as the goddesses of justice as a lord of karma she tempered justice with mercy and balance in order to act with the golden qualities you must let go of your own projection and uh, project and see the old picture when you receive the card lady portia is calling on you to review an aspect of your life or relationship to bring it fully into the fifth dimension be generously 
uh, arched hope in your mind and fear and step aside from judgment and then your ascension part will be showered with gold i love these cards this is what we all need to understand so what does lady portia want you to know in this week i am fair-minded open-hearted and non-judgmental non-judgmental people you need to be non-judgmental i want to say thank you to you virgos please like and share these videos thumbs up and namaste till next week